Alright guys, today I've got a video here on my Galaxy S4, but this isn't strictly for the Galaxy S4. This is for um, pretty much just general information about stuff you download off the internet for your Android device. And what I want to show you guys is show you guys how to check an MD5 sum. Um, so what an MD5 sum is, just to kind of give you a general information on it, is it's a number that is generated by the developer that when you run the sum on whatever you downloaded from them it should match the number that they have on their form so um, I'm gonna show you guys some some stuff here uh, one way to check the MD5 sum and I'm gonna show it to you using ES file explorer so if you go into ES file explorer and let's say I where did I put this thing I think I put it in SD card nope I didn't I'll show you here. Should be in SD card. Okay, so here it is right here. This is CM 10.1. It's just a folder. And then these are the Google applications, the newest Google applications I've downloaded off of Google Manager site. So what you're going to do is you're going to highlight that in ES File Explorer. Then you're going to hit More. You're going to hit Properties. And right here it says Show Checksum. So you're going to hit that. And then you're going to highlight the MD5 and then you're going to say calculate okay and it comes up with this long ass number normally what i find is if you just take the last like five digits that's mostly what matters so you got an 8c 8eo 8c 8eo so if we go over to the computer and see what the md5 is for these google applications that i have on my phone we'll check that out so let's go over to my computer this is the Google applications that I downloaded and here you can see it 8C8EO this is the whole number um, so I downloaded them to my computer and then I put them on my phone so you can you can check this is the number so here's the application right here and then this is the number that I've highlighted so that you want to make sure that this is what you downloaded and when you run the MD5 sum it generates this number if it doesn't you probably have a bad download, something like that's going on. So the other thing I want to show you guys is we're going to copy this, copy it, and then I've got a program on my computer which is very easy to use right here is what it is. It's called MD5. And whenever you copy something, it just auto pasted in here. So you can see that MD5 number is in here. Um, and then what you can do is you can hit browse and go to where you have downloaded those files too when I've downloaded mine here and here's the Google applications again and you click on them and it's gonna check see the bar going across the MD5 and then it says right here the codes match and that proves that you have a good download now why am I showing you this guys the reason I'm showing you this is it's super important when you're downloading um, not so much ROMs but when you're downloading stuff to flash like uh, bootloaders and things like that that you check the MD5 sum so for example here is a uh, Odin file I can flash now if I download this but it and then I run this uh, MD5 sum and it doesn't match it could be a corrupt download and you try to flash that to your S4 now you might brick your device so it's super important that you guys run the MD5 checks whether you do it through the phone and ES file manager or you do it through this program like I have right here I'm gonna give you guys a link to this program right here um, so that you guys have it It's pretty pretty easy to do you just download it, install it and it looks like this very simple so I'm gonna give you a link to that obviously you can see ES file manager you can go ahead and do um, MD5 checks in there but just very very important that when you download something in the man and the developer gives you an MD5 to check the MD5. They have it on Saijin mod. Here you go. M MD5 sum. This is their number. Right there. And I and this is Saijin mod for the S4. I just did this one too, so I'm gonna copy it. And then uh, we'll close that. Look, I can open this up. There's that number again. We can browse. Here's the file. And it should generate and check it again. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys this so that you don't accidentally break your devices um, because you, the file got corrupted or it was a bad download or something like that. This is always a good thing to check. I have this utility on my computer, ES File Explorer, on my phone. 
And that's it. I just want to show you this uh, as kind of a safety precaution for you guys. So universal, basically how to check your MD5 sum on anything you download from a developer's uh, page or forum. So hope you guys like this. Uh, as always, hey, check me out right up on top here at rootjunkie.com. You can follow me over on the site at Facebook or Twitter. And we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.